doing the uh, main pressure points of the legs. Okay, so you got the um, side of the hip and your sciatic nerve, which is basically on the on the back side. Then you've got a little point here, and then where the knee is on the side of the uh, of the calf, you've got this one here. It needs to be hit in a forward direction, so like, so, like this. So it's really grazing the feel up. Mm -hmm. uh, then at the back, you just turn around. You've got the um, the calf muscle. You can hit that directly, and then just under that the uh, Achilles tendon at the top, uh, which is best to squeeze like in a like a lock. And then on the inside, <coughs> where the ankle bone is, if you hit that anywhere from just above the ankle bone on the inside of the, uh, like there, uh. that hurts quite a lot. Then you've got the metatarsals, these are metacarpals, metatarsals on the toes. So it's metacarpals for hands and metatarsals for toes. So it's tarsals for toes. So mm, that hurts a lot. That's exactly, it's just the same as that. Okay. And so even with shoes, this is why uh, ladies' uh, stilettos hurt so much. Because there's uh, over a ton of pressure. Oh. Okay. So anywhere on the inside of the uh, of the leg, oops, the knee. It's all the way. Any all the on the inside of the chain. It's all the way. So if you end up in this sort of position where you're on the ground, you can still hit the metatarsals and you can still hit this. So yeah. Okay. If I'm doing this sort of movement where and do the leg lock. Yeah? Well, among the uh, back of the Achilles tendon at the moment, which is kind of the normal. Yeah? Now, the defense of that is to shoot the leg forward into this position and put his. At this point, I then go further up to this point here. I don't know if you can see. Here. So instead of being on the the Achilles tendon at the bottom of the ankle, where you're breaking the ankle. I'm going to be at the bottom of the, the calf muscle here. So if he does the uh, defense, if he push, I move up to this point, which is here, which hurts just as much actually. It won't do as much damage, but will hurt. So I've got that, and I need that there to uh, lock his leg out. So, I'm breaking his ankle there, he pushes it out, and then I go for this point here, and I'll get the same result. It won't break it, but you'll get a tap out. Okay? If I'm sat down and this a guy approaches me, then I'm, uh, I don't have to worry about his hands too much when I can do stuff with the legs as well. So it's no good doing this because it'll pull me off the chair. Yeah. But if a guy comes up and he's a bit too close, then the, a major point, the middle of the leg, I can press the point. It's up there. It's there. Where am I from? This? And it's a femoral artery, a fem femoral nerve. And it comes out about here. So we're uh, here. Middle of the leg. Halfway from the hip to the knee, and it's a very small point, it's only about the size of your thumb. As it comes in, I can go in there, and that's your reaction. Give it a rub. Dave? Thanks. So, You can see your reaction, you don't want them to lose. No, thank you. No. <laughs> okay, so that's your femoral nerve. It's not the main one, which is about here. It's your femoral artery and nerve. Uh, halfway up here, and we've done that on another video. 
and you hit that, and the, the artery and the nerve are close together, and they disappear again for a bit, but it comes back out here, um, and then it comes out the back of the leg, so that's your femoral nerve. Okay, if you're doing this sort of technique, yeah, before you get hit in the uh, guts and it's all too late, as you come up, bring your elbow down, Just bring it down to Clyde with him, right in the nerve. There. Okay, again. There. You don't do it, you don't want to do it more than once, really. Not really, no. No, because it hits the femoral nerve every time. Okay. And you've got what walking to do tomorrow. Okay? Yes. <laughs> so, you just raise your knee. So you bring in this into here each time. And you only literally have to move into there. And you go straight into the spot. And you're not going to be kneeling, kneeing into me more than once. No. So the Muay Thai guys don't believe me. Try it yourselves and see how far you get. Because it's not you, know, you can't build this up by kicking trees. <laughs> okay, it's one of your main moves. Okay, as it comes in, yeah, yeah, again, there, again. I'm not going to do it too hard because it really hurts. Yeah, you don't have to be that accurate. You can do it with your fist. Machine gun running. Okay.